Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, give me a second, my volume is probably going to be a little low. I uh, forgot to switch over my uh, audio to increase it a little bit. There we go. Sorry about that. I have this weird program that uh, every so often just lowers my audio for whatever reason on my mic. It's kind of weird. Anywho, welcome back to Final Fantasy IX. Um, off screen, I did do what I promised I was going to do. I did do the whole leather wrist, uh, leather wrist, wrist. This isn't this isn't Valkyrie profile. Leather wrist, um, steeple hat thing. I got uh, three co cotton robes, which is awesome. Um, I also got Zidane's uh, two new weapons: the butterfly sword and the ogre. Um, what's that? Is an, our new ability that we get, which will give us a new ability for our dine. Uh, can't remember exactly what that is. Give me a second, and I will tell you. It is the Scoop Art, which is a two times normal damage to a single target. Uh, what this effect does normally, what's that, is quite literally the old trick in the book. You point in the background and go, what's that? And enemies turn around and you can do a back attack, which does extra damage. That's literally all that is. Uh, Soul Blade, I don't remember what that is, what that does. Um, I think, if memory serves, it will allow you to inflict the status effect of the weapon you have equipped. If I'm remembering correctly. Could be wrong, probably am. We'll find out in a few minutes. Actually, I'll find out right now. Um, let's see here. Throw the hidden power sword. Yep, that basically allows you to uh, use status effects effects on your uh, weapons. Now, as you can see also, this weapon has a different icon. This is because this is a double-sided sword, which is one of Zidane's weapons. He has daggers and dual-sided swords, which is really cool. Um, a few characters have multiple weapons, like Dagger has rods and rackets. Rags allows her to throw energy enemies, and rods allows her to go up and beat the crap out of them, which is awesome. Um, this is kind of what you want right now, though. You want glass armlets, which you can make and buy. Glass buckle, which you can make. And you'll also want... Scroll down. Where is it? A few cotton robes. Usually, I think two. Auto. For uh, your other characters later on. Um, FYI, Soul Blade can be made into uh, to Shift Break, which is two times normal weapon damage to all enemies. So, pretty helpful. It's the uh, upgraded Tidal Flame. Alrighty then. I uh, think that's about it, all you need to know. But there is a few things I will tell you in the future. That will make the game just so much easier. Okay. Wow, this, that smells really good. I think I'll buy one. Can't forget my water. Dang it! Oh well. This is a lot of unusual things. Nah, VV. Is this food? It looks good. It looks like the sesame buns that Grandpa used to make. Aww. Alice Item Shop. Festival of Hunt sale ends today. Wow, there's going to be a festival? <laughs> oh, Vivi. Hi, I want to buy this. Oh, are you friends with the Moogles? Huh? The item is called a Koopo Nut. Koopo Nuts are Moogles' favorite food. Now, there is a side quest involving Koopo Nuts. Uh, we give them to a certain Moogle, I believe. And uh, after a while, we'll get, we'll get items each time we turn into Koopo Nut. However, comma, we can only carry one coupon nut at a time, so keep that in mind. This one is uh, first given. Oh, I didn't know that. I think that's the last one. Go ahead, honey, it's on me. Really? Thank you. Aww. Um, what is this festival of the hunt like? Well, we let a bunch of animals loose and... Oh, there's going to be a lot of animals. Sounds like a lot of fun, thank you. Oh, Vivi. Be sure to let her finish. What's so fun about fighting savage beasts? Wait a minute. Did I say animals again? Aww, Vivi. Vivi, Vivi, Vivi. Okay, so. I'm not going to go to the industrial section because there's not much really there. Um, you can, however, find a leather wrist, bronze vest, a mimic card, and a steepled hat. So, feel free to uh, go there if you want to. We're going to the theater district. Here we can find 127 gil, an autograph key item, a Moogle suit key item, 
282 gil, 68 gil, 97 gil, and the mini Burmesia key item. Alright. Okay. Did I go to the extra section or am I in the right place? I'm in the right place. Okay. Steam engine. I'm lost again. Where is the princess? This town's big. The castle's big. Why does everything have to be so big? Hi. Pardon me, can you tell me where I am? What, you're lost? Gee, you're a soldier for crying out loud. This is the bridge that connects the castle to the air di airship docks. The big building in front of us houses the docks. Jeez! What is that large airship? Amazing, isn't it? It's the Hilda Grade 2. See, because I can't cough. Instead of underwater, water, my throat gets going to get dry for a little bit. This is equipped with a steam engine developed by the region himself. It can fly without mist. Impossible. How can it fly without being powered by mist? This is very similar to saying, um... That's a good example. Trying to come up with a different way to uh, propel something without electricity or gas. It's kind of what it's like to Steiner. What cave did you crawl out of? This is the age of the steam power. The source of steam power is water. It's much safer than mist. <laughs> A bright future awaits us all. Alrighty. Okay, so let's see here. We got that. Let's check the fence in the foreground for some money. Pigeon turret alert, thanks. Oh. That's that. Where is the fence that they're referring to? Here it is. 127 gill into the nearby house to raid for an ore. Oh, it was on the list. I didn't see that. <clears throat> we do need a few ores. Alright, got that. Turn to the street and head to the next screen. To our left, that building right there is the Townless Headout Hideout. We do not want to go there just yet because we'll continue the story. Continue down the stairs and talk to the fan club members for a scene. Oh no, I can't believe this tour ends today. Stop pushing. Hey, who are you? Who am I? I am Sir Z Zidane of Tanaist, uh, the greatest bandit in the world. Have you ever heard of him? No. Aw. Go away, stop bothering us. Ouch. Hurry up! Where's Lowell? How much longer do we have to wait? Please, he'll be here in a minute. Kiss me, I love you! Hi, everyone. Oh man, what's so special about him? Jeez. Thanks. I love you guys. See y'all again? Really? Ouch. Damn, I can't see a thing. <laughs> Sorry, we ahead. Okay. Thank you for coming to see Moogle Wannabe 2, Kukupo. I care about you and your stupid show. The game's in lol. Whew. Hey, you're. No, I'm not! Yo. Alright, so the fall of the Moogle. Poor guy. It's tough being popular, I should know. So we're following him back to um, somebody dude's house. I think it's the uh, house with the, uh, the ore we got. You're at the theater. Oh, please, don't tell any. Uh, you're at the theater. Oh, please, don't tell anyone about this. Please, I'll give you this. Autograph. 
Thanks as always, Michael. Jeez, I can't finish my painting without you bothering me every day. Come on, forget about the painting. Let's work together. You can express your artistic talents on stage, too. Don't ever compare your acting with my art. If you're done with your bit if you're done with your business, get out of here. We can examine this. For the muggle suit. I have absolutely no idea what these are used for. Like, none whatsoever. I'm actually kinda curious what they say, because we can we, we can check out the key items. I have, by the way, never gotten these items before. I love this, by the way. We can see why it, why it was fake. It's because I want to see your crow, not I want to see your canary. I love that they actually include that. Uh, Koopa Nut. Koopo. Koopa. Koopa. Po? Koopa. Koopa. Po! I love it. It's so cute. Chop, chop. Koopa. Ah, uh, Moogle's so adorable. Lola Bridges, born in Trenno, raised in Lindblom, famous for his masculine charm, starred in Moogle Wannabe 2. Oh. oh, it's so well made, the fabric is nice too. Little Ilya would love it. Eh? I can't have it? Aw. I have no idea what they're used for. I'm about to look them up. If I find out what they're used for, I'll mention it in the next set. But, uh, ne yeah, the next set. But, uh, for now, yeah. Let's continue onward. Then on. Go into the building. I figured they, uh, there wouldn't be anyone here. Looks like no one's been here for a while. Ah, stretch. What to do, what to do. Jeez, Zari, that late? I wonder what Dagger's doing. Okay. What can I do? Oh, Stagger. A bell's ringing. A performance in the theater square must have ended. Theater district. Is there anything you need, Your Highness? Holy hell. So... <laughs> I have no idea how royalty or the rich deal with it with people waiting on them hand and foot. I would be so freaking nervous about that crap. I'm like, I, I'm going to the kitchen to get a sandwich. I can make it for you. No, 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 no. no. I, I, I want to make it myself. Seriously! No, thank you. I'm thinking of going outside now and look around. I'm sorry, Your Highness, but we cannot grant this request. Right now, there are many people coming to Lindblom for the Festival of the Hunt. Therefore, things are quite chaotic in town, making security rather difficult. Also, very few people know your, of your presence here. Is, is for your own safety, please understand. Yeah, it'd be a shame if she got kidnapped, you know? Especially during a performance of some sort at the theater, you know? Kinda weird. Okay, I understand. I would be so freaking bored. I can't stand sitting around like this. I think I'm here to be protected. I just want to help mother. She's a good daughter. There he is! I told you he'd be here. Why don't you tell us that you're back? We're in Thomas too, you know. What? Yeah. Uncle Baku said if we find some treasure, we can be in Thomas too. Yeah, check this out. Wow. Those are Trick Sparrow's wings. This sure some this uh that sure is some treasure you found, all right? Yay! Yippee! Aww. <laughs> so, did the plan work? Yeah, Princess Garna is at the castle. Really? Wow. So, what's she like? Is she cute? Did you ask her out yet? <laughs> they know him so well. No, I think she's pretty busy. Plus, she's a princess, and I'm a uh, you know. So, I don't know. I bet she misses you. Yeah, you should go see her. Good luck. See ya. Wonder if she, I wonder if she got to talk to Sid. Maybe I should go see her. Alright, let's loot our, loot our, loot our base. Alright, so there are three chests that we can loot for money. And the bunk, or the beds at the top 
should have a mini Burmesia. Yep. What is this? Uh, it's the most coveted piece of the famous... I don't know. You'll never see a rare item. Okay. Burmesia, I believe, is a uh, city. So we have a, a small city now. All right. Baku and his crew. Sorry, I accidentally muted the mic. Achoo! Whew, that tasted good. I can't believe we found a way out of the evil forest before I got petrified. It's all thanks to our bro, who pointed out the river he took the map to Zidane, before he took the map to Zidane. What are we going to do now, boss? We gotta save our brother. You're right. But first, we'll let the guys outside drink some water from the lake. Sina, bring them over. Hey, yeah, about blank. I think it's better that the evil forest stays petrified. Are you serious? Don't get me wrong. I had saying this out of concern for our safety. Then why? I'm sure he wouldn't want to be saved if it meant evil meant evil force was going to be restored too. You're right. We gotta start looking. There's gotta be another way to cure his petrification somehow. We ain't too late. I don't think they actually state it outright in the game, but basically the implication is that Baku somehow was able to pull off a mass petrification of the forest. So this is why he feels mostly responsible for him being, uh, for Blank being petrified. We gotta do what we can. Which leads, leads you to wonder, how strong is Baku? I got you, boss. It's either that or when we killed the plant brain, the entire forest got, uh, petrified. One of those two options. Hey, Sinna, what are you doing over there? The spring water might make some good coffee. I'll get I'll get the fixings. Do I gotta remind you what happens to members who don't listen to their boss? Yeah, they get petrified. No, no, please not that. I'll bring everyone over right away, right now. All right, off to see the princess. Yeah, I think the uh, artifact and the um, autograph and the oops, Moogle suit are just uh, random key items you can get that serve no purpose. There are some like that, like the mini Burmesia doesn't really have a purpose as far as I can remember. Again, could be wrong, probably am, I'll look it up. Um, but a lot of that fun stuff. You can, we can find just random stuff throughout. But most of the key items do serve a purpose. Oh, I know! The key items uh, could probably serve for my overall um, item hunter rank. Uh, later on in the game, we get a uh, uh, item hunter classification. The higher it is, the more rewards we get from a certain shop and stuff like that. It's actually a trophy to get max in that. Um, so that's kind of what that's all probably about. The key items really help uh, boost that uh, ranking. Hey Rusty, how you doing? What are you doing here? You, what have you done with the princess? Where is she? Well, take it easy, I just got here. The princess is gone, she was supposed to stay in this room. Maybe she went out for a little walk. How can you be so calm? It's a very serious matter. I feel so bad for Dagger. Seriously, she goes to the bathroom, all of a sudden the entire castle is on high alert. She takes a nap in the library, and then all of a sudden, you know, there's war with another another kingdom. Have you gotten all the dangers she faced just to get here? And whose fault is that again? For having the queen blow up the ship? Yeah. Well, something terrible happens to her. What am I, uh, what am I doing here? I must go out of my way. Don't cough. Alright, let's do a quick save. As a side note, I did get the other uh, trophy back in the village of Dolly. 
which is to um, get the what's it called the high rank uh, thing the rare uh, fortune reading that's it the, the very the very good omen I did go and get that I wonder where she went. Ah, the music. That song, I've heard it somewhere before. A sweet voice. It's Dagger. She's upstairs. She really, the, the, the really did a good job getting a voice actress to play that, uh, this voice. Sorry, only authorized personnel to use the lift. Man, I've got to get past this guy somehow. If I disguise myself as a guard, he'll let me through. All right. I love the I love the, the song. It's really soothing. All right, where there you are. Hello. Hey, wake up. Huh? I just saw a suspicious character wandering around. What? Where? Upstairs. Follow me. What an idiot! No, in here. All right, you show yourself. Hey, what are you doing? You need to borrow your pants and your g-string. There we go. That was easy. All right, I should be able to get to the lift now. Excuse me, friendo. Just coming through. Do 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 do. Get a cough again. Much better. All right. Turn to the left. I don't see any chests. We should be good. I did find out we can skip cutscenes in this game now, which is awesome. All I have to do is, uh, I'll show it. Press X and you can uh, skip cutscenes. I'm not going to skip any of them, though, so keep that in mind. Ah, uh, such a pretty cutscene. Nice song. How'd you get up here? This is a restricted area. Come on, I do this for a living. Oh uh, yeah, you remember Atalus. It must have been easy for you. It really was. If they were to make this game via like a uh, Final Fantasy VII, that this uh, part is gonna be a lot harder. I know it. Whew, what have you? Hey, there's a telescope. Let's go check it out. Come on. Dang. Hmm. Watchland. There's probably a lot of weird things living there. Maybe check it out sometime. What we're doing with this, by the way, is uh, marking stuff on our map. Those are the mountains that surround Bermisia. I guess the best way to get there is through the cavern at the base. Oh, the south gate. I wonder if they're if they've started repairing it. It'll probably take a while to fix everything. Seabell River. The river flows right by South Gate. You can get to the gate by walking along the river. Good to know. There's a chocobo. Hey, there's a chocobo. They may catch a chocobo in that forest. There is something I'll mention about this forest at the end of the set. It's actually kind of important. I'm basically going to break the game, thanks to this new thing. Alexandria is beyond those mountains. 
I bet they're looking at us. Looking for us. Let me see. How's the view? I've made so much trouble for everyone. Uncle Sid knew everything. That's why he asked Silas to get me out of Alexandria. No matter how hard I try, I'm, al I'm always a step behind in everything. I'm so helpless. What's wrong? Zidane, why did you help me come, to come here, to Lindblom? Is it because your boss ordered you to? It just I just wanted to help you, that's all. The boss didn't agree uh, with me. So I ended up leaving, ba uh, leaving the band. Really? I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. It isn't the first time I've left. So Don. Yeah? Um, how are you planning to abduct me? We were going to put, uh, put you to sleep with sleeping weed, then kidnap you. It's mostly used for kids, but a big dose can knock out an adult just as easily. I guess you didn't need it since I came um, along on my own. Hey, would you mind giving me some? I've been having a hard time sleeping lately. Hmm, I don't think that's a good idea. You might get addicted. Maybe all you need is some company, eh? Oh, please. Do you think I'm that naive? <laughs> can't blame me for trying. Yeah, kind of can't. Uh, that song. <laughs> Were you singing it in the village of Dolly? Yes, so you're up that night. What is that song anyway? I don't know. I can't even remember when I learned it. Where I learned it. I sing it whenever I feel sad or lonely. For some reason, it comforts me and reminds me that I'm not alone. I guess it's a mystical song. Let me hear it again. Now, I'm going to talk over this a little bit because it is kind of a copyright song. Hmm. I never expected to find such a fine armor in a place like this. Yeah, I'll buy that one too. Who knows what, uh, when that brawn will start another war. What? The queen would never start a war. You dare speak ill of the queen? Who the hell are you? I'm a, a, an armor collector. Oh, well, in that case, can you recommend some good armor? I, I must go. Go to Pluto, yeah! What are those things? They look so stupid. I'm going to take Sid's airship and destroy them. Hey, cut out! You broke my night! I'm going to tell your mom. No, come on! Action figures. Royal action figures. Those black mages were like toys, being controlled by someone. The sky looks ominous. Looks pretty to me. Something's about to happen. Sir Fratley, where are you? I need you. Aw. As I was going to say, I believe Dagger's theme song actually is, uh, You're Not Alone. Okay. It should work now. It's a really nice song, look it up. Sire, it's no good. What? We can't stabilize the engine systems. It can't run for more than ten minutes. Darn it. My mind hasn't been the same since I became an Oogloop. Yeah, just look up Final Fantasy IX, um, You're Not Alone, or something like that. It's a really good song. Hey, Dagger. So, when do you want to go on that airship cruise? What are you talking about? Hmm? What am I thinking? I asked the girl at the... Never mind! Well, it sounds like you've asked the wrong girl. Wait, I can explain. Why bother? Go have a wonderful time. Oh, Zidane, you... S you blew it! Okay, how about this? If I get first place in tomorrow's hunting festival, you and me will go on a, d on a date. I on a date. How does that have anything to do with me? Yeah. Come on, please. Fine. Okay, it's a date. Hmm. Side note, it doesn't matter if you want, you don't get a date. Maybe a tradition, but this is a dreadful festival. So many lives lost every year, especially because of him. 
Harley, the festival is a test of manhood. I tingle with excitement every year. This is the last carriage. All the preparations for the festival of the hunt are complete. Very good. Now we wait for the signal. Yes, sir. Oh, boy. The things have been freed. What? We mustn't... Uh, we haven't even received the minister's authorization. We believe that they're going to release him any minute. Alright, release the muse before they let him loose. Hurry! I love the moves, they're cute. Look at the little guys. They're like foxes. All is ready. Alright, stand by. This year's specimen is perfect. Nobody can stop him. <laughs> what power? Hey, make him stop. It's too early to let him loose. How? I have no control over him. Dang it! Open the gate at once. The gate's gonna fall apart. Go, Zongo! Jeez! Alright, let's see here. Princess Princess, you might actually like it, okay. What if the Don has improved his skills? Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Alright, let's begin. Oh. Uh, time is 12 minutes, use air cabs to go to other districts. Once you lose in battle, you're forced to retire. The winner will be crowned Master Hunter and receive the Hunter's Reward. Who will come out on top? What do you wish for your Hunter's Reward? No, I'll go with Gil all the way. I'll take an add-on. And you, Mr. Mr. Vivi? What? I never signed up. I thought you did pretty well, so I signed you up. Don't worry, with your black magic, it'll be a piece of cake. I don't know. That was very inconsiderate of you, Zidane. Oh. How about this? If you win, I'll fix you up with a date with Dagger. Me and the princess? Shh, keep it down. What was that? You just mentioned the princess. What evil deeds are you plotting now? It's nothing, right, Vivi? Yeah. So what would you like for your reward? Um, I'll take a card. Okay, Gil, that on end. A card. The festival will begin shortly. You'll all have different starting points. Hunter Zidane will start in the theater district. Hunter Freya will start in the industrial district. And Hunter Vivi will start in the business district. Okay. So, there is a trophy to, um, what's the phrase I'm looking for? To win as Vivi. I'll teach you how to win. Uh, it's actually very, very easy how to win this game. Uh, let's see here. Um, even though it will say other hunters are taking the lead and stuff like that in the upper left-hand corner, that's all just for show. There literally is only three possible winners. Vivi, Freya, or Zidane. Um, if you win as Vivi you get the uh, theater ship card, which is the uh, Talentless ship. Uh, Zidane gets 5,000 gil, which is kind of pointless. And Freya will get the Coral Ring, which is what we want. Um, it absorbs lightning and teaches her the ability Lancer, which is a good ability. Um, it also teaches a few other abilities that can't remember off the top of my head. So we're aiming for that. Not departing. Okay. All right. Oop. So yeah, my advice is um, don't uh, save before doing like I just did. Go out, win as Vivi, reload, and then win as Freya. Such rudeness, princess. They are treating you like a commoner. Oh hush. We got a great view from here. Hmm, you're right. I can see the entire town. Princess, look, Master Vivi is also participating. I can't believe he seemed so reluctant earlier. Master Vivi, the princess and I are rooting for you. Come on, Vivi. Aw, you can do it. No, Master Vivi. I got, oh gosh, I can't, I can't watch you anymore. You can't win by running. A good offense is the best defense. Attack. You can't lose to that monkey Zidane. Racist. Yes, that's it. Now's your chance, one more time. Find you. Let's go. 
Jeez. Okay, so we need to wait until, um... Four minutes, thirty seconds. So we're just killing time till then. All right. Come here, you. All right. This may cause a little lag. I apologize. I'm opening up the information about this uh, hunt. My guy doesn't have information about it, so. All right. Another job, EXP, AP, or Gealer item, so we're only getting points. I'm going to pause right here so I can explain all this. Alright. Uh, you've seen Fang, Moo, and Trick Sparrows, mostly. Doo -doo -doo. The business district has around 90 to 102 points in total. Theater, which is where we're at, has 40 to 48. And Industrial has 46 to 54. Uh, do. So yeah, we're pretty much just waiting until Zonga Hole appears, which is at 4.30. So until then, we're just fighting enemies. What? I saw that. I don't want that turned on this time. What? <laughs> So I was uh, given a heads up on what the battle assistance actually does in greater detail. Like it will um, auto trance, keep your HP and MP up pretty much, and your ATB, your attack uh, gauge, will be pretty much filled the entire time as well. So it's pretty much just set there if you want to kill something quickly, here's how you do it. But it's one of those things that it kind of takes the fun out of it, you know? Unless you're trying to get through this game quickly without actually trying, there's no point to using it. Nice crit. There's no point actually using it, in my opinion. Anything in here? Nope. Freya leaves with 54. Nice Freya. Whoops. I did it always once. Come on, Trick Sparrow. See, those kids killed one of these things and took its wings. That's messed up. Hardcore. Come on, and whoop. I love dual-bladed weapons like this. They're so cool. I think they're called Thief Swords, uh, officially. It's locked. Okay. Right, so we still have some time. Let's head over to the industrial area. Alrighty. Like I said, we're trying to get uh, Freya to win. Now, there's a very easy way to get Freya to win. All you have to do is go into a battle and kill yourself. That's it. That's pretty much what I'm going to be doing once we get to uh, the Zagnol battle. Zagnol, yeah. If Zidane is uh, unconscious by the time a battle is over, which is when uh, later on, um, he automatically drops out. If you want Vivi to win, um, I'll explain that in a little bit. For the trophy, actually, I'm really playing right now. Um, in a little bit, we'll get into a battle with uh, Freya and our party. Very simple. Um, hey, to get uh, Vivi to win, guaranteed. All you have to do is attack yourself. Have Zidane knock himself out, have Freya knock herself out, or vice versa, and Vivi wins by default. Like I said, all the other names up on left, like Gero, uh, Genero, like we just saw. That's just flavor text. It doesn't matter. It's always going to be me, Vivi, or Freya that wins. And then there. Oh, it's a moo. What do 
What is cool, though, is um, if you take too much time doing certain hunts, enemies will be found dead in the streets. Enemies that you could have fought if you were quicker. So if there actually are 